Oops, dropped all the cheese. Shoot. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Hyped by Allison. If you haven't watched any of my videos, I'm Allison and I am going to get you hyped in a healthy way. Today we're going to do something super fun. I got a package in the mail and I'm going to go ahead and grab it. I kind of already opened it because I needed to know a couple things before the video, but I'm going to call this the official unboxing because I'm with all of you guys. With my friends. My YouTube pals. I'm going to go grab it and I'll show you what it is. Okie dokie. I already opened the box, so I'm gonna grab what's in there. Oh, there we go. All right, it is another product from our favorite company, Grecho. If you've seen most of my videos, you've probably seen a Grecho item because I've done a lot of them. I've done the portable blender, the amazing pan that can switch into a plate and has a removable handle. And now we're gonna do this. And what is this? This is a fondue set. And this fondue set is not just your typical fondue set. It is a digital electronic fondue set. This is the best design fondue set you will ever have. It has automatic functions to create fondue out of chocolate, cheese, and broth. Each fondue function is programmed to maintain its ideal temperature throughout. That obviously means better fondue. It's easy to use and has one touch operation. You can use this at parties, you can use this while watching sports, or you can just use it to celebrate a good day. We're gonna go ahead and open this up and we're gonna talk more about it. And before we get started, I wanna thank Richo for sponsoring this video. And I also want to remind you to please subscribe to my channel for more fun content like this. Give me a big thumbs up and follow my Instagram. All right, let's open it up. We got some recipes here because, you know, it's easy to have something right at hand. I mean, the internet's great and you can always search on there, but if these come from the Grecho source, I wanna try them out because everything Grecho is wonderful. And yeah, we got some directions here, but let's get this fondue set out before we uh, read these. All right, that worked. Can't forget these. And it's orange, that's awesome. Perfect for uh, October. As you can see, the size is perfect because it is very portable. If I'm headed to a party or a family member's for a holiday, the size of this makes it so much easier to bring in the car. And just a little FYI, this product is dishwasher safe and can be easily washed with soft cleaning tools. All right, these are pretty cool. I just had to show you guys. There's a different color for every single one of these forks, forks, not sure what they're called. All right, I'm gonna dig into the directions and then I will be back. So I found a couple cool facts I wanna share with you. It's just so great. It says that the product was designed to make your fondue experience hassle-free. And most of us know that fondue is not the easiest or cleanest thing to work with, but with this it is. It also says each fondue function, chocolate, cheese, and broth is pre-programmed to maintain its ideal temperature throughout your meal and can be adjusted at any time. So the pre-programmed temperatures make it so that the fondue will never come to a boil and will stay at like a perfect temperature whenever it's on, which means you're not gonna have any little burn marks in your pan. You're not gonna have black burnt cheese or chocolate, which is great in my opinion. And overall, it just kind of makes it so you have a fuss-free food experience. And we all know that fussiness happens when things are stressful in the kitchen. And yeah. These are called forks, mm -hmm. found it here. So we had to resituate because the cord did not reach. But that is okay. Now we have a different background. I placed this right here on top. And as you can see, we got the uh, whole unit right here and it's all plugged in. We are ready to start cooking and we're gonna start with our pot. And I've got some broccoli garnish for the cheese. You can use whatever you want, but I'm trying to keep it semi-healthy. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the first couple ingredients in and then we'll put it on the stove. We're gonna start with greasing this pan up so it doesn't stick and we're going to use our extra virgin olive oil. Ah! 
Oops, dropped all the cheese. Shoot. <laughs> okay, we're gonna put one cup of our provolone and mozzarella blend, which in my opinion are a little bit on the healthier side of cheese, especially the provolone, a little bit lower fat content. We are going to add some flour to thicken it up. So we're gonna do four teaspoons of flour. And I'm gonna use our very own SinFit Butter Herb Seasoning. And this is like my favorite seasoning from SinFit. Don't forget, you can use my discount code. I will put it in the description, hyped by Ali20. Get money off your order of SinFit. Just wanted to throw that in there because this flavoring is amazing. I'm just gonna kinda have a little fun here. Alrighty, it's time to add some liquid. So I'm gonna be using almond milk and chicken broth. The chicken broth will give it some good flavor. So we're gonna do about three quarter cup of the chicken broth and the same for the milk. And now time to mix it up. And now it's time to put it on the stove, heat it up, and turn it into fondue. Now that this is on the stove top, we're gonna heat the pot over medium heat, stirring constantly with this uh, wooden spoon until the cheese is melted and the mixture is nice and smooth. So let's get going. Now that the cheese is simmering, we're gonna make sure that the plate is heated up. And just a heads up, for cheese, you need to do it two to five minutes ahead of time. The directions guide you depending on the type of fondue you're using. I probably should have started a little earlier, but that is okay, it's still gonna work out. We're gonna go ahead and heat this up just so you know the levels are preset for each type of fondue, which is so convenient. So we're gonna go ahead and turn it on, and of course, make sure it's plugged in first. So we got that and we have cheese. So we're gonna go ahead and press cheese. When it is all ready to go, the lines here will be solid. All right, we're gonna place this on the heating plate. And now we can strategically place these where they belong. As you can see, there's little notches here so they don't fall back into the fondue. Brilliant idea, right? If you were at a party, you would pick your color and I would obviously pick red, so I would only use the red. All right, now that this is all ready, it's hot and fresh, we got to get our garnishes. And today we got some pulled broccoli and some pretzels. A little variety if you ask me. But remember, you can make it your own. I just want to remind y'all that you don't always have to eat healthy. Once in a while, we can indulge. So with a fondue set like this, you can use whatever cheese you want. You can choose the healthier version of cheese, or you can choose your favorite cheese that may not be the healthiest, but make sure to do it all in moderation. Same thing goes for chocolates. If I was going to choose the healthier version, I would choose the higher percentage of cacao, so darker, more pure chocolate. And if I wanted to go with the uh, unhealthy version, I would choose milk chocolate because I'm a sucker for milk chocolate. More of the story, have fun with this, but just remember, you can modify it and make things healthier, especially with the garnishes. You can go with candy, like licorice, in the chocolate, or you can go with fruit, like strawberries or apples. And then, of course, with the cheese, you can go with veggies, or you can go with white bread. Whichever you choose, make sure it's a healthy balance. And now it is time to taste test the best part. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my red, open up the broccoli. Can't do it. Can't do it. And I thought I was strong. No, I think it's just the plastic. Gonna wash a couple. And now, we're gonna take our fork and we're gonna pick up a piece of broccoli. Which one, which one, this one? We're gonna dip it in and we're gonna take a bite. And just remember, if you don't have that many people, you can set these aside because right now they are taking up the whole thing. I will leave one for AJ here. Mmm. All right, the true test. Before I take a bite, just wanna let you know that I can see that this heater is keeping the consistency perfect. One, 
two, and three. Wow, that is amazing. And that Tin Fit powder really added some good flavor. I'm just gonna uh, summon AJ over here to get his opinion on it. Here and there's a yellow fork here for you. Alrighty. He's not as short as me. <laughs> How hot is it? Not very hot. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. You dropped some broccoli in there? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> And while you're here, let's try a pretzel. Let's see how the uh, salt goes with the cheese. With a pretzel, I would say just dunk it in. Just be sure not to burn yourself. All right. Cheesy pretzel, here we go. Mmm. I do like broccoli, but I'd have to say I like the uh, pretzel cheese combination a little better. Uh-huh. Now I want another one. I want another broccoli. I like the broccoli better. Really? Too salty. I love salt, what can I say? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> you think of broccoli? <laughs> All right, guys, as you can see, this little fondue set is just impeccable, amazing, and creates a delicious side dish, hors d'oeuvre, or just a snack at a party. I've never owned a fondue set, but I am beyond impressed, and I love the fact that it allows you to choose chocolate, cheese, or broth, so you don't really have to worry about gauging the correct temperature. It keeps everything evenly heated, so you don't have a burned cheese sauce or chocolate, which obviously wastes your product. I also think this is just the perfect size because I hate lugging around big kitchen appliances, and I'm small so you know I like to make use of the space in my kitchen as well I hope you enjoyed learning about this digital electric fondue set and if you want to get your own there is a link in my description click on it get your very own digital electric fondue set make sweet make savory bring it to a party bring it to a holiday function or just enjoy it after work in the comfort of your own kitchen and also remember you can indulge try to eat a healthy and nutritious diet, get your micronutrients, get your macronutrients, but sometimes indulging is just part of life. Which brings me to this amazing item. Use this to indulge or to eat healthy. We're going to go ahead and close out this video. Thank you again to Grigio for sponsoring this video and for sending me this amazing appliance. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Give me a big thumbs up and a thumbs up for the uh, Grigio. Also, follow my Instagram and remember, indulging and just living a balanced lifestyle can help you to stay hyped.